Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, because today, I'm going to be making an update. So, if you've been a fan of my channel for at least a week or so, I made a video where I took my carnivorous plants out of dormancy, which is a week ago, so, probably should have seen that. Um, but I'm just going to be making an update, show you what's been going on, because... It's a lot of growth. Yeah. So, obviously there's a major difference already, just seeing it. I've trimmed up my lettuce, which is starting to literally stalk up like a tree. Kinda weird. Tomatoes. That is just monstrosity. I've not even gotten tomatoes. At this point, I'm just filling up the water daily. They get, like, they're burning up against the LEDs and literally stalking away to steal the light from my other air gardens. It's kind of ridiculous at this point. Um, where to start on the Venus flytraps? I do not know. Let's go with the pitcher plants, I guess, over here. So, still, like about two or three months ago, I made a video about planting cobra lily seeds, Drosera riga seeds, I don't know if I'm saying that right, and Nepenthes truncata seeds, but none of them sprouted, so. I mean, I guess it's just because it's been too long and they're just not like. They're just too old, I guess. They they couldn't sprout. So that's kind of a bummer because I was really hyped up for that. But here is my Saracenia Alada. We got damn nice pictures coming up. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Nice, nice, nice. Gorgeous plant. Really enjoying it. And it's going to do really great. You can see some of the freaking camera just fell off. Oh my gosh, it keeps falling. Sorry. Oh, uh, you can see some of the dormant pictures here. Yeah. And let's move on to another carnivorous plant. Let me actually move the light that I have for them. LED. Just so that I can light. Well, I still want it, but I want it to shine on them so you can see the coloration. But I want to be able to use my camera, so. Just hope that's enough. Right here, this one is my Saracenia Flava. Nice picture coming up. This is a dormant budding picture that never even grew. Um, so there's two pictures on it. Last summer, when I first got this plant, it only had one picture, and it's just been not doing well because every time it shot up a picture, it would lose the uh, already existing picture. So it was only picture like one at a time. But this year, I'm going to hope to see some more better growth and a stronger year overall because I just hope to see more than one picture. This oh my gosh. As I was saying, uh, I just hope to see more than one picture this year. Already happening. And then, you should also know, if you were a true fan, that I got a Saracenia purpurea. Beautiful plant. It's a Venosa by the BTW, just in case you don't know. And these were its pictures that it came with. Small, cute, little buddy one. But it just received this big, nice picture. This is the first picture that I got since I got it. But it finally shot up a nice, good picture. And it's already getting some good veining in there. And nice shape. So I like that. Let's move on to the flat traps, shall we? Um, red dragon, just a few buds. Typical DCXL. This is my main DCXL, if you've seen in my tour video, which I believe was only my second video on the channel. Yeah, I was pretty shy back then. Um, this plant had about one inch traps, but I believe this is the year in which it will get one and a half inch to two inch traps, I hope so. Um, uh, this is my oldest plant. Beautiful. I fed it some freeze-dried bloodworms, because those ideally have all the 
nutritious things that it needs to grow as fast as it possibly can. And I've really seen some big lush growth already coming up on it. This is a four year old plant and let's hope I can make it five. So back here. Also, I forgot to mention it started flowering, but I had to cut it off because I repotted it this year. I want to put its energy into its chops. I kind of just cut off all the flower buds here just because next year I'm going to let them all flower out and big and nice, but this year I'm going to have to cut them back to get traps. Um, this is just a typical that I got last year. It also has a flower bud, but I can't really reach it. It's still pretty small. This is also a typical with the flower bud. This one I can actually reach. I'll probably just make a video of the removal on that. The heck? My arrow garden is beeping. Let me unplug it. Hey, be quiet. Ugh. The heck? Well, there you just saw that. That was the water system, meaning it's too low on water, so it's just gonna be annoying to death. Well, thank goodness we're done with this. I'll fix that later. And now, right here, pineapple with some air plants, vine, roses for Valentine's Day. I haven't made a Valentine's video, so happy Valentine's Day. I kind of feel bad that I didn't do that. Um, this is my banana plant, which is getting bigger, very bigger. I like it. It's growing nice leaves now. That's nice. And then here are just a crap ton of typical Venus fly traps. They used to be all on my windowsill, but I figured out it's like impossible to water them like that. So I leave them all in this big tub in which they're all just getting some buds. Not much. Okay, and then Penthes Ventrata. Really nice. If you saw my tour video, you would also know that I'm not good with Nepenthes, so all the pictures fell off. But I finally am starting to see some buds that are, they look like they're worthy of becoming a pitcher. Like when I say that, I mean like, oh my gosh, sorry. Uh, when I say that, I mean the pitchers are red, starting to inflate, tendril are growing out, rather than just being a small nub head and not doing anything, but just absorbing my resources that I have for my fly traps. So that's kind of it. Not much, just update of you know what's going on in the spring. And there we go. See you in the next video. I know there's gonna be pretty poor lighting here just because who knows how bad the lighting is. See you all eventually soon whatever time you are free i'll see you in the next video goodbye